Thank you. Drugs kill. Drugs killed Enora from France after exposure to fentanyl in Florida. She was 19 months old. Drugs killed Firdos, an 11 year old girl in Antwerp, caught by a stray bullet, an innocent victim of criminal warfare. Drug kills the rainforest, trees cut down for coca, chemicals from their laboratories, polluting the environment and destroying the conditions for life. Drugs are a threat to health, to life and to society. We can only fight this threat together with comprehensive actions. Thank you very much, Secretary of State Antony Blinken for this timely initiative. Thank you for your leadership in bringing this coalition together a coalition against the threat of synthetic drugs, a threat of epidemic proportions ravaging your country, killing more than 100,000 people last year. You can count on the support of the European Union to make this coalition a success. I thank you for ringing the global alarm bell, or as you said, being the canary in the mine, for warning us. In the European Union today, Cannabis is the most used drug, heroin is the deadliest drug, and cocaine is the most seized drug, with a record 300 tons in one year alone. But we too see growing threat of synthetic drugs, synthetic opioids, which are extremely addictive and kill in very small doses, especially when mixed with other drugs. And these synthetic drugs are easy, all too easy to produce and to smuggle. New synthetic opioids constantly appear in the European market, 74 different kinds in the last 14 years, and more and more they are produced in the European Union. As demonstrated by the more than 400 drugs laboratories dismantled in one year alone. Drugs damage people's health and damage society. Drugs crime is the most profitable organized crime. Criminals use the profits to buy people, to buy power, to buy murder. In the European Union, criminal violence is growing in scale and in brutality. It's time to realize that, at, at least in the EU, that organized crime is as big a threat to our societies as terrorism is. And we can only fight organized crime together as a global community. It takes a network to fight a network. And today I want to commit to you that we will follow up on the words spoken today with effective actions and that shoulder to shoulder, with the United States and with all of you in the global coalition, we'll do what we can to stop the devastating spread of synthetic drugs. Thank you.